So let, let's talk a little bit about, about the synthetic turf here. Okay. Because we're, we're seeing a lot of people use that in design. I think it's great in so many ways. Uh, turf is very water, very fertility, mm -hmm. um, you know, intensive. And there's a lot of maintenance that goes into keeping it looking nice. There is. So our other garden, Hayes Fairchild, it has a nice little circle area there. And we've redone the grass there twice. And it still yeah. doesn't look great. Um, so in here, we decided to use artificial turf. And we put down a layer of crush and run gravel, pack it down, mm -hmm. put the artificial turf on top of that and then used an infill to help the grass stand up. It has a couple of different colors, has thatch in there even. So yeah. it's a great use and it doesn't doesn't wear out. So Right. And it, it's come a long way. So for people oh, yeah. for people who are thinking like, you know, old school Afro turf that you'd have in like the mud room in your home. Right. Uh, it's so different from that. Like you said, there's even, you know, they even simulate the thatch in it. You can get, mm -hmm. you know, different heights, you know, and even things that look like different types of grass. So right. if you haven't thought about it in a while and you want like a nice little turf area, go take another look at it. Yeah, it's a great option. They have so many um, different selections out there right now. So, yeah, and some of them are more expensive than others, but yeah, you know, it's a great option. It's a brave new world. It is. <laughs>